Oh my goodness, I know that has to hurt. Just looking at it makes me feel pain. If we keep doing this, there isn't going to be any hair to braid. It's time to expose African braid shops, y'all. This is Nikki for Chic Lady T. So I saw this post floating around on Instagram and I thought I'd share with y'all. I don't know who did this and why they allowed this to be done, but this has to stop. I think that this calls for us opening up dialogue about black women losing our edges due to tight braids, y'all, and to expose the African braid shops that are doing this. Now I am a huge fan of protective styles. It's how I grew my hair long, but I am not for braiding practices that are damaging and actually cause setbacks. I've gone to braid shops to get my hair done a lot and found the treatment of my hair there to be discouraging. Now, I finally found a good African braid shop that I will talk about later in this video, but before I discovered them, I had to go through all kinds of stress. First, you have the braiders that won't listen to you. I literally ask for one style but get another. The style I want is usually safe on my edges and causes less stress on my hair than the style that they try to give me. Then I ask for one size of braids and get another. For example, I ask for jumbo box braids because I know they are less damaging than micro braids, but they make the braids tiny anyway. More like medium small. It's a good thing I don't ask them for medium braids because I would get micro. Next, they are rough with my real hair. They treat it as if it will weave and break it off while braiding. Third, they cut and burn my hair when cleaning up or sealing the ends of the weave. Because my hair is long, they often miscalculate where my hair ends. And honey, lastly, don't let them do a takedown. You can kiss your edges in your new length goodbye. But the point of this video is not to drag African braid shops because it's not all of them. I found one that takes very good care of my hair and knows their stuff. They take their time with my hair and don't braid tight. When they do a sew in, they don't thread your braids together so you can take care of your hair underneath with ease and they don't get annoyed if you ask questions or get directions on how you want your hair. But I know some of y'all might not be as lucky to find a shop like that, so in the meantime, I say learn how to braid your own hair. Or just go ahead and show the braider this video before they get started and give them some passive aggressive education on what you do not want them to do. Also, we aren't without guilt either. Right here on YouTube, box braids are being installed with rubber bands. A braider did my hair like that years ago and I literally had a whole braid fall out during takedown. And although that was a long time ago, the hair still struggles to grow there. Take this as a warning. Rubber bands may help your synthetic style last, but you won't have any hair when you're done. So what say you? Do you have a braid or weave horror story? Let us know in the comment section below. And we didn't forget about y'all, it's time to announce this month's giveaway winner. And like last month, we have two. The first person is Miss Nover. She has been the most active on this channel. Thank you. It's because of you and all of our subscribers that we can do this. The second winner will be chosen randomly from the comment section. Alright, let's get to it. Daisy May. All I have to say is since it's your hair, do you. And with that being said, educate yourself or do your research when it comes to either doing your own hair or getting it done by someone else. Stop trying to get the cheapest slash quickest fix that may end up turning into an inexpensive long-term problem. Congratulations to the winners. Please inbox us. We will verify it's you and deposit the $20 into each of your PayPal's. To everyone else, we do this every month, so you just might win next month. Make sure you subscribe, comment, and turn notifications on so that you won't miss the announcement. Thanks for watching. Catch you in the next video.